Hey, what's good everybody? Welcome back to another Champions of the Continent video. So the official Twitter has notified us finally that we've hit all of the pre-registration bonus goals that they put out. And the last one that was left that was the unnumbered mystery gift, which was announced to be 300 rubies. And to be honest, this is pretty generous. Um, a lot of us were thinking that they were gonna give 88 or 30, so 300 is, is pretty great. And if you checked out my last guide video, you know that 300 rubies equals one full 10 bolt pull. And I can almost guarantee that we will all be receiving this day one. I don't think that there is an actual milestone for this. I think Square Enix is just trying to get those last minute pre-registrations, which is totally fair but I would 99% expect this in your inbox when you load up the game on day one. So I wanted to discuss what my pull plans are now, knowing that we're going to have 300 rubies gifted to us on day one. Now, assuming that the first character we pull will be a five-star traveler like in the beta, I'm going to be re-rolling for Theo no matter what. I want him to be my starting character, so he's goal number one. From there, I'm going to be using those three Yubis that they're giving us to pull right away, and I'm aiming for Lynette or Viola. Now remember, using 300 rubies for a temple does not guarantee a 5 star like in other games. There's going to be many, many, many rerolls that I'm going to be doing in order to have both Thea and Viola or Lynette. Who knows, I'll get three. Just kidding. But those are the three that I'm going for. And if you remember in my character guide, so Theo is the apothecary and he is my go-to. Started with him in JP, I love his sprite. Think he's a really good starting character. Um, Viola, if you remember, is the queen of debuffs. She's still relevant in JP today. She's gonna carry you through a lot of content and be super uh, beneficial. And then Lynette is the queen of debuffs and she's a really good breaker for fire and fans. So all three of these characters, if they were to be you know, pulled right away, fantastic. But I do want Theo in one of the other two. It's going to be a really time consuming practice and I don't recommend everybody approach the game this way because it's gonna be really frustrating and it can be really demoralizing to keep pulling, keep doing it over and over again and feel like you're not getting anywhere. So I would just say, know yourself. If you know this is gonna turn you off, just don't approach it this way. But if you're really patient and you know this is something that you wanna start off strong, then I would recommend getting your first five star and then um, using those three, 300 rubies to get another five star that you're going for. Um, but just know, remember, if you don't get one or the other, then you kind of have to start the whole process over again. So as I'm sure you can see, it is, um, it, it's gonna be frustrating for sure, but since I'm gonna be making content for this game super regularly, um, I do wanna start off strong and I'm aiming for certain goals and I think that this um, 300 rubies is gonna be a really good place to start. So we are only days away from the launch of Champions of the Continent, and I don't know about you guys, but I'm completely stoked. It wasn't too long ago that we were all thinking that you know the game was never going to be released, and I was thinking that the game wasn't coming until September, so it's, it's a really exciting time, and if you're coming across this video and you've still kind of been weighing on whether or not you want to uh, join the, the, this game in this community, I think that the game is uh, starting us off really strong, especially if we our first poll is a five star, and now we have these 300 rubies. It's a really good time to get into the game, highly recommend it. So who do you plan on re-rolling for with the 300 rubies that were being gifted, if you even plan on it? If so, who, do you, who are you aiming for? Let me know down in the comments below, and don't forget to subscribe, like this video for more Champion of the Continents uh, content, and I'll see you guys soon. Peace.